Hello Taurus, this is your daily for the 13th through the 14th for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you're new, welcome to the channel. And uh, please hit the like button, share the video, subscribe to the channel. Here we go. For my Tauruses. Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs here. Angel Prayer. Let's see what we got for my Taurus friends here. We have healthy choices. Thank you, angels, for guiding me to make healthy decisions. Mm. Let's see how that plays out for today. That is your thing, guys. The sun. Huh. The star. And the ace of wands. I love it. Hmm. A lot of you have just realized that, you know what? Something is not working for me. I need to just let it go. Move on to something new. Start over again, okay? Dust yourself off and start over again. That is what this is. It's like, you know, realizing that, hey, I put my all into something and it just was not working. So leaving that behind, realizing, awakening, um, being enlightened, and healing from that. Taking what you know and healing from that, dusting yourself off, picking yourself up, and starting over again. That is what this is, okay? I love it. Love it. We have Leo, Aquarius energy here, okay? Now, Leo and Aquarius are, are opposite signs, so, hmm, let's see. Maybe you have one of those placements in your chart where the person that you're dealing with here. Let's see why this is happening for you guys. Huh. Aquarius energy right there. There you are, Taurus. Maybe there was an Aquarius that you were dealing with that, um, you know, you, you guys just did not see eye to eye. They, you know, you found out some information about them. Maybe they wanted things their way. Maybe you wanted things your way. Maybe you guys just weren't vibing together. They don't have to be a horrible person. They could be, but they don't have to be. Sometimes you just don't see eye to eye. Okay. But I mean, you're standing by what you believe. And I feel like what you believe truly in your heart, you feel like, okay, this is, this is what's right for me. I'm not wanting to hurt anybody. And I also feel like you guys are sharing the love here with the Hierophant and the Star. This is a very spiritual card. Um, and of course, the Star is healing. This is like sharing, you know, your healing energy with other people as well. Okay. I think this, this air sign here, <laughs> excuse me, guys. This air sign here is also um, realizing something, but I think they're, they're just a little um, selfish, uh, maybe, you know, egotistical here. One more card. Yeah, another ace. The sword of truth. Very spiritual energy here. Very spiritual lit energy. Knowledgeable takes action, does what they feel is right here. I like this, Taurus. This is wonderful. Let's see what your influence is here. You've been through something. You've been through an awakening. You've been through an awakening. This person probably prompted that awakening. So whatever it is that you guys went through here, I feel like this person brought it on. There were things that were going on between the two of you that they just were not working for you. Even if this person is somebody that you feel like is your soulmate that you've been with forever or you felt like you were supposed to be together, still, you have walked away from that. You have walked away from that because something was broken there. Okay, this is someone that you have spent um, many lifetimes together, I feel. But if 
you know, if you're not on the same page, regardless, then, you know, sometimes you have to walk away. It's just what's best for the both of you. And it is necessary sometimes um, to kind of go in your own separate corners to address whatever issues that you have been like, you know, pushing down inside of yourself. And then maybe you come back together here. Okay. Let's see what the outcome is here. Hmm. Excuse me. <clears throat> I think Taurus, <clears throat> whatever happened here between you and and your person, this air sign, I think it's left you um, not really want to take a chance on this again. I just don't feel like you are wanting to revisit this situation. Okay, you're just accepting the differences between the two of you, and I think you're just wanting to move forward regardless of the, the strong connection that you feel with this person, okay? So that's what I have for you guys, and I will speak with you soon. Bye.